Hi there, my name is Mr Bridger. Um, I'm a PE teacher and football coach. And what I've got for you is uh, another four minute football based Tabata session, 20 seconds of movement, 10 seconds of rest for four whole minutes. And um, really what you've got to try and do is get as many reps as you can in in that amount of time. And um, we'll start off quite easy as a sort of warm up. By the end of it, you need to be working as hard as you can. Um, I know you footballers will be missing the game. It's really unfortunate that there is no competitive football out there at the moment, um, but it will come around sooner than you think. So it's important that you keep active, you keep practicing. And these sessions are really based on raising the heart rate, um, some sort of uh, fundamental movement and close ball control. In terms of safety, make sure you're wearing appropriate clothing, make sure you're wearing appropriate footwear, and clearly make sure the space around you uh, is safe, especially if you're doing this indoors. This is the alleyway beside my house, uh, and this is the area I've been using to do these workouts in. Um, so if you're ready, if the space around you is ready, I'm gonna put on some tunes, and hopefully we'll get ourselves a really nice Tabata-based workout. Um, which will raise the heart rate and also get some of your close skills improved. The first thing we're going to do is star jumps, ball in two hands. Here we go. start. Next up, opening the gate. Do this in football training all the time. Out to win with your knees. Here we go. Three movements next time, ball on the floor, we knee, knee, and then squat. Here we go. Next one, toe taps. Ball on the floor, keep it under control, tap the toes alternately. Next one's tricky. One foot on the ball, you're gonna hop around it, and then the other foot on the ball, hop the other way. Tricky one. Um, one leg squat, ball to one foot, then jump. Well done, it's tricky. Next one, we're going to close the gate rather than open the gate. Ball in two hands. Next one, skill based, using the bottom of your foot, roll it along the ball, roll it back, then swap to the other one.
well done one and all. Um, very good effort. Really important that you keep yourself active, um, that you stay safe, and that you um, keep practicing those short control skills in whatever space you've got available. My name is Mr. Bridger. Keep practicing. Until next time.